right, it's a uh, cold and dreary, cloudy uh, day in February. You got the Hell Deep Digger here, and I'm on my next hunt, my first find. Clad quarter, about inch and a half, two inches down, uh, not very far. Uh, this would be clad quarter number 49. And for you newcomers that uh, haven't uh, seen a number of my videos, um, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to break a thousand clad quarters for the year. Now, last year I got pretty close. I uh, actually found 992 uh, clad quarters. Uh, this is clad quarter number 49 for 2015. Um, I kind of uh, uh, ran into some health challenges in 2014, but uh, I'm up and at them for 2015, and I think I'm going to go ahead and give that record a run. Uh, as soon as I break a thousand, I'll go up to 1500. But uh, right now, I'll be happy with uh, clad quarter number 49. All right, on to the next one. Hey folks, I'm getting a, a screaming 8687 signal on the Garrett AT Pro um, just below the surface, maybe two inches down at the most. I'm going to go ahead and dig this live. I'm not sure what it's going to be. Hopefully it's not garbage, but uh, you know, a signal that uh, pops up and almost blows your eardrums, you can't, uh, you can't ignore that. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and dig um, pretty much every good crystal clear signal that I get today, and we'll see what we can get. All right, stand by. Chasing it with the pro pointer, and I'm, I'm even getting a loud pro pointer. It looks like it's just below the surface here. I'm gonna go ahead and cut a small plug and see what's going on. It looks like it's in the plug. Oh, here we go. Clad quarter. Number 50 for the year. Clad quarter. Let me let me scan the hole real quick. Let me move this plug side. I'm getting another signal down below. I'm gonna go ahead and put the clad quarter down. This is a this is a little bit deeper signal. I'm gonna go ahead and and dig that and see what's going on. Huh, that's interesting. Looks like it's more on the side here. Sometimes the uh, Pro Pointer uh, has a tendency to fault, especially if you don't use a uh, brand new fresh battery. So I'm going to turn it off and turn it back on again see what it says. Yeah, still getting a strong signal. There. Whatever it is, I'm right on top of it. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Two more clad quarters. Did you see that? One and two. Two more clad quarters. So it looks like a pocket spill. Oh, that one back in, back, fell back into the hole, there it is, so one, two, three, check the hole, I'm getting, a <laughs> I'm getting another signal here, stand by, I'll continue to dig this out.
still some more in there. digging a little bit off the side of the hole. Cut a side plug off of my plug here. Oh. <laughs> Another quarter. That makes four. Nice little quarter spill. And yeah, check the hole. He's a hell deep digger, yeah! How deep are you going down today, baby? Hell deep. There we go. Four clad quarter spill, about uh, two to five inches down. Here's the hole right here. All right, there you have it. Another one from the Hell Deep Digger. On to the next one. All right, uh, looks like my next find uh, was coming up as um, a 77, 78 on the Garrett AT Pro, about two inches down. Looks like I've got my first kid bling for 2015. Uh, looks like a, a ring. Um, I haven't looked at it pretty closely, but I don't really, don't really think I need to. I mean, it's pretty obvious that that's kid bling. Um, let me zoom out for a little bit there. Again, 77, 78 on the Garrett AT Pro, about two inch and a half, two inches down. There's, there's the hole right next to it. I just laid it on the plug. It's like a black and a little bit of metal. metal. It's not that big. It won't even fit on my pinky. All right, there you have it. Kid bling ring. On to the next one. Okay, the next one was coming up as a mixed signal, and uh, well, now you can see why. I got a clad quarter uh, next to a stinking Lincoln. I was mixing up the signal. Uh, I was hitting from uh, 77 all the way up to uh, 88. So, um, little, uh, little, little spill there. But I believe that's clad quarter number 55 for the year. So, um, I'll check my math here. A little bit later, I, if I have to, I'll make an adjustment during the wrap-up, and I'll announce the count. I do plan to announce the clad quarter count uh, after each hunt during the wrap-up, and uh, hopefully, like I said, at the end of the year, I'll have a thousand clad quarters. All right, on to the next one. Ah, uh, stinking Lincoln, about three inches down. And it really fooled me too because it was coming up in uh, high 60s, low 70s. I put it on the plug. There's the hole. Yeah, it was coming up as a uh, 67, 68. And um, on the Garrett AT Pro, that's generally where I find gold rings. But uh, every now and then, yeah, it happens to us all. All right. On to the next one. Okay, I got two signals. One in the uh, one in the hole, and uh, one in the plug. So uh, they were coming up uh, between 83 and 88 on the Garrett AT Pro, about four four and a half inches down. I'm gonna see if I can move my camera here for a better angle. All right, hold on. So it turned out to be a quarter in uh, 
uh, clad quarter and two pennies. Not sure if we got this on video. See if I can do a better job in repositioning the camera and taking a look at this. There you have it. Clad quarter. And this is number um, 58. Clad quarter number 58 uh, for the year. And as many of you may know, I'm trying to chase, you know, a thousand clad quarters by the end of the year. And I had about, you know, $250 in uh, cash in my pocket. All right, on to the next one. I'm not exactly sure what that is. I think it's one of those new vape vape pens, vape pipes. Um, not into uh, smoking and you know that's kind of a personal item so I'm just gonna leave it there. I don't know if it's got what it's got in it or it looks like it is broke or broken. And uh, there you have it. Just goes to show you know, you never know what you're going to find. And you're out there digging for, you know, old clad or, or old silver money or even rings and jewelry. And then this is what you find. All right, on to the next one.